Yes, they certainly look like the favourites at this point. Never put anything past these players. We have called the women's singles match, the swing match. All of these encounters. It's the first 30-point match. But for now, we have a 10-point match between the junior doubles girls. Pune versus Chennai. Yeah, the action is always so exciting at the very end. So, as a commentator, I'd like to see Chennai closing the gap. Aggressive start there, aggressive start. Way to attack the net player. Well, Jeevan, a lot of these girls over here, I have seen them going straight at him, straight at the net player. Seems to be paying off. Lovely shot there by Smriti Vasan to give Pune Warrior 2-0 lead. She saw her opponent closing in the net. Brave shot, went for the angle, made it. Cross there by Kavya. The real difference so far in these three points is the energy level. I know it's only 10 points to play, but you have to find ways to show positive body language. It can always swing points in your favor. Just long, second serve. to see Sanjana Sirimala run all the way backwards as her partner was running forward. Not, not <laughs> conventional doubles there, Jeevan. Yes, it's just not on the same page, Som. There's a lot, lot to learn from these youngsters. A lot to learn. It's going to be in play. Well, that's one way to do it. 4-1, Pune Warrior, take. side chain. And I'll tell you what. They really needed that. A little bit of luck. Never hurt anybody. Apart from your opponent, of course. But uh, on that occasion, at let cord. Something we do play. Nandan Bal, very intense man. Purav Raja taking charge of the Pune Warriors team. Always been a leader, Purav Raja. I'm sure Nandan Bal has told his girls to be a little bit more proactive, a little bit more aggressive. Go for their chances a little more. They only have five more points to play here. The girls change sides. Let's see what they've got in the box now. Score 4 1 in favor of the Pune Warriors. Oh, a lovely serve. Lovely serve there by Kavya Sony. She's got such a nice motion. Really gets up tall. We'll see here Kavya Soni for the Pune Warriors. Oh, that's just a beautiful serve once again. Six one, what Pune a weapon. Warriors. Especially on these quick courts here at the Celebration Club in Mumbai. Well, you must think that the double specialist Purav Raja is loving seeing the team contribute so many points in all the doubles categories so far. Shanks going the way of Pune. So I'll tell you what, I'm very impressed by this young girl, Kavya Soni. Of course, she had two big serves earlier on. She's also very active at the net. Big return. Big serve. Good stuff all around. Oh, 
wow. Eight one, who they wanted. Really going after that one. Jeevan, she reminds me a little bit of young Sania Mirza. <laughs> exactly, she's playing loose and free, especially with the lead. She seems to have the instinct of doubles, ma making those early crosses and being brave to hit the ball on big points. Well, that's going to work. Thank you, Pune too Warrior. Late, too late as an 8-2 scoreboard is something Pune will take any day of the week. And a total score of 21 points to 9 favoring the Pune Warriors. That's a very crucial girls doubles encounter. And will that be the most important thing that's happened so far? The final scoreline, eight, 8 points to 2 in the match you just witnessed. Girls under 18 doubles. Just to add to the 9-1 win that the boys under 14 doubles had. So the doubles so far for Pune being extremely important in them getting that massive lead. And so far it looks like Pune does have a massive advantage.